all right guys welcome back to another subnautica video uh so what we're planning to do is do the last thing we got to do in the game which is go to the captain's quarters before they lost communications hq uploaded blueprints to the main computer got to go to the captain's quarter and we got the code right here so what to take i don't know what to do all right you are done Is it turning nighttime? Wow, perfect landing. Perfect. Absolutely wonderful. Alright, now you charge and then let's see what's in. Storage, storage. That's it. So yeah, it is, uh, it is turning night. So let's see if we can actually go to bed. Hopefully I can. I'd like to be able to see. Okay, I can't go to sleep, very nice. But yeah, we'll go to the captain's quarter and then after the captain's quarter, you'll understand what's gonna happen next. There's a lot more stuff on this Simonica map still. Like a bunch more stuff. Or not a bunch more, but there's like little uh, decorations and other th things that you get. And probably some... Uh, actually, I think that's pretty much it. I don't really can think of anything else that there really is on the map. Because you pretty much got everything. Or it feels that way. <clears throat> uh, the, the series is almost over, folks. And then... We'll start some other series, and then uh, there's Subnautica Below Zero, which this is Subnautica, Subnautica Below Zero, so. It's been a while since we actually have uh, drove around with Sally, honestly. Ava's back there, and this is Sally. I remember we we were uh, over here and we were just grabbing some scrap, some crystal. <laughs> Good times. And I had a terrible mic back then. You can still say my mic's bad or I'm just bad at editing and doing all the stuff. But at least I'm trying. And also I can get better with the sound. But I need, yeah, I do need to get better at the sound. Ugh. But at least I am trying. We're almost there. Boom. And then over here, the tree biome and stuff. Coral. I did explore this thing, right? Let's see. Uh, yeah, I did. Do I have first aid on me? I do. They were in a no man's land. Which is basically a Reaper Leviathan area. But at least I have a proximity, uh, thing to bother. Uh, like a shock. Electrotherapy for the little big red boy. Yeah, yeah, Get on my way. Alright, so the captain's quarters. Uh, we just can go up there, I think, so. And we'll be fine. So much shaking. You would think after all this time, it would stop shaking, maybe? Just a little bit? And stop being so much on fire? 
Because I'm telling you, all this metal can't be that flammable. Can it? I'm no metal specialist, but I'm pretty sure that this metal floor isn't going to burn for seven plus years. Well, this was the captain's quarter, right? This is not the captain's quarter, is it? Administration. Locked behind the prom bay. Okay, I see. Let's get moving. We don't got that much food or oxygen. I don't know how long we can survive. No, okay. Under the sea. Cuttlefish egg discovered. Ooh, cuttlefish. Drive room, sea moth. Drive room. I don't need to go to the drive. Prombre? Yeah. This is such a well crafted game. Good for all ages, honestly. Maybe maybe not a two hundred year old person, but you know. Alright, nice. We already made a stairway a long time ago. Very long time ago. Captain's quarters. All right, two six seven nine. Two six seven nine. All right, let's go. These are my things, my posters, my mini figure ship. What is this? No signal. All right. Loading program Craig McGill Simulator dot V Rat. Size one player. Captain Hot Dog. Blah blah. blah. Resources normal. You're exploring a quiet alien backwater when your ship arrived uh, here. It implodes. It must be blah 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 poachers. Quickly, what will you do? Farm alien plants. That's what Craig McGill would do. After forwarding for some hours, you collected a number of potentially farmable food stuff. Which will sustain yourself with? Starwell eggs. With the Starwell eggs are nutritious, the life cycle of these vast space faring creatures is much too slow to sustain a farm. And besides, their mother is extremely angry with you. Accept your fate. Craig McG um, McGill's, you know, there's no reasoning with a mo mother scorned. You're not so much torn apart as swollen whole and disintegrated. The atoms that you thought were you are gradually redistributed. In service of the Star Wars, continue survival. Would you like to continue? No. <laughs> Average long range transmission delay, eight hours. Opening last to recorded transmissions. This is an emergency distress call. Aurora is on collision course with planet 4546B. Sending all available environmental data. Please respond with rescue solution out. This is Altera HQ. Attached to this message, you should find the blueprints for an escape ship that we calculate will be capable of breaking orbit and getting you back to the nearest phase gate. Now, it's designed to use materials you can find and sit you, but it's gonna need one hell of a power source. Now, we'll be sure to... Aurora Long Range Communications, really, offline. This is the emergency stretch stall. Blah blah blah. Alright, I'm gonna do this again while I'm walking. Range transmission delay, eight hours. Opening last to recorded transmissions. This is an emergency distress call. Aurora is on collision course with planet 4546B. Sending all available environmental data. Please respond with rescue solution out. This is Altera HQ. Attached to this message, you should find the blueprints for an escape ship that we calculate will be capable of breaking orbit and getting you 
back to the nearest phase gate. Now, it's designed to use materials you can find in situ, but it's gonna need one hell of a power source. Now, we'll be sure to... Aurora Long Range Communications Relay, offline. Oh yeah, this way is fine. I remember. <laughs> no, I don't. Tee -hee -hee. I suck. Oh wait, I could have went. Yeah, that way. Why? I just, I do suck actually. I was looking at my other screen and I missed that jump. Alrighty then. Oops. All right, well. Whoa. Welcome aboard. I get to shock you guys. How does that feel, huh? Bum. Ouch. That hurt. He doesn't look happy at all. Not gonna lie. Can you get moving? I can't go. Whoa, he's getting close. Wouldn't you say? Shoo, go away. Go, go, go. Goodbye. Good. And dead is she. And dead is she. Uh, so we did, uh, the captain did a stretch call to HQ, and they responded eight hours later. I'm surprised our communication stayed up for that long. And we got a blueprint now. Uh, which I will open it up when we get closer to base, instead of being over here. Or maybe just at base. Or maybe just right now. Where did it go? Where is it? Boom. The launch pad. Neptune launch pad. Yeah, we're gonna gosh darn make a ship and get off this planet. Let's go! This episode, we'll start uh, building a platform and do a little bit of stuff, but then after that, nothing much. Maybe the next episode, I'll already, like, cool. I'll just gather all the resources we need, honestly. Yeah. I'll get all the resources we need, and then make the video on me making the ship completely with all the resources. And then after that, probably, uh, that would be the last episode, maybe. I think. Yeah. There should be no reason why one of those are so close. Well, doesn't it just make me so happy that I can hear one of them close to my base? Whoopie doo. Let's go. This is why I make my base all the way down here, away from all that.
All of a sudden, turn around, boom, jump spare. I feel like I should definitely download some scary games to play on the channel, maybe. Give anybody that's watching a heart attack. Same for me. Welcome aboard, Captain. All right, all right. Um. All right, let's go to bed. After going to bed, we'll do. We get that titanium. We need titanium. We need some lead, and then we need a computer chip. A little chip, I. That's what they call it. French fries and uh, potato wedges or something in Britain, I think. Chips. Alright. Uh, do we have the computer ship? No, oh, we do not. Oh my goodness. Don't come. Alright. If I grab one of these, grab this. Alright, let's put a. Nope. Here we go. Aura, the next phase of uh, trying to find a place. I don't think it really matters which way I put it. Yeah, look at the ship. Very cute. Um. Give me some chips. Give me some coffee. Alright, so while that's going, I need a look. Titanium, 10 pieces. I'll keep that. Even though I do know how to make, of course, titanium ingots. Four pieces of lead. I do think we have the lead. And then the titanium, I don't know how much we have on there. Coffee. Delicious. Alright. <laughs> my little friends yes there I forgot you guys live these still haven't grown man hi a small gray colored herbivore the cuttlefish displays high to tell uh, levels of intelligence curiosity and attachment Strangely, this species have not been encountered in the wild, and the scanned specimen had to be artificially hatched within the alien containment unit. Life cycle. In the absence of wild specimens, little can be known for certain about the cuttlefish's, cuttlefish's life cycle. It is possible that environmental conditions have changed, forcing the species to the edge of extinction, leaving its eggs in permanent stasis. It is also possible the cuttlefish have been genetically altered or even imported from another world. Hello, fish boys. Uh, I want to just keep them in here and then live off forever, but you know, eventually me be, me leaving this world, I'm a uh, nuclear reactor and the bioreactors are going to be gone. Dusted. Technically, that's the lore, but... Uh, hmm. Let me drop one of them outside and see if I want to keep the other one inside. All right, me boy. Hi. Play with it. High five. Well, I gotta let your twin brother be here somewhere, so I guess. What do you got for me? Yeah, you want a little treat? Here you go. <laughs> you guys are so adorable. High five. Play me with again. Belly scratches. Oh. Oh. Oh, he learned. Alright. Alright, give him another one. He did not learn. Oh, he has learned. Alright. You guys come over here.
I need you guys to be safe from these creatures. So you guys follow me. And then I'm gonna release you guys. You guys can stay over here because it's safe. All right, I'm about to execute order 66 now I'm thinking about it. Hold on, where are you going? No attaching my cuttlefish. All right, well, this area is pretty safe for you guys. All right. Let me say goodbye to both of you guys. Because we gotta, we gotta do some stuff. There you go. There's another uh, emote that's really cool, but I mean, uh, what's it say? Another. Uh, a thing that they do, which is very cool, but it hasn't happened yet. Which I'm just like, really? Uh, oh yeah, we need to go down here anyways. We're good on water. Alright, so... Let's get... Oh yeah, we do have enough. One, two, three. One more piece, boom. We have enough titanium. Alright, and then let's get some... Gold... And then we do need some coral. Do we have copper wire right here? Yes, we do. And some coral. Let's go get some real quick. Goodbye, fishy mans. You guys stay here. They love me. They love me. I should have hatched them sooner, honestly. Now I'm thinking about it. Because technically, next episode, probably our last episode, maybe? Where am I going? I don't know where I was going. I gotta go this way. Because, yeah, technically, maybe the next episode is our... Uh, might be the last episode, but I might put, do another episode. Uh, even after we end, end the series. But I won't tell you what I'll do, but... There's a possibility. And I streamed... Oh, wait, no. I already talked about me streaming and how, like, the audio got messed up. And hopefully I can fix it next, next time. Oh. Like... Oh, uh, let's see. I'm moving. That's why it's so weird. I forgot what I was going to even do. Oh, yeah, I do. Right here, boom. Let's go. Hmm, hi guys. Oh yeah, that one. <laughs> that one's amazing. Alright, well, I can't just let the other one just not get any attention. What am I... How dare I? I wonder what treats I'm giving them. Crushed up potato crackers or something. Oh, I just realized I need another one. And I could edit this out that I need another one, but I'm not going to. Pretty lazy day. And it kind of brings back to the roots of where I didn't edit at all. And you guys saw me get the raw resources and blah, blah, blah. And waste your guys' time. Alright. Let's, let's drink. 
I'm drinking pure vodka. No. Whoa. Wow, it scans like every piece of the grass. It looks weird. You see that? It's nice living down here. Hello, guys. Goodbye, guys. Alright. Uh, right here. And then we actually gotta make the ingots. I almost forgot. And then we'll call it quits for this episode. Make the ingots. Make the other one. Now we gotta make the rocket pad. There it is. I need lead. Let's go. Isn't it just so nice that I forget these things all the time? Like, it really just makes me want to just... Where's the lead right here? One, two, three, four. Yep. All right. Now, can we actually start? Hello, baby. Reef back. Yeah, this place is just uh, like not as learning when you have the reef backs and like that, and constant those bitey fish it keeps you on edge. But I don't like how right there. Oh, gosh darn it! Okay, whatever. Build it. I don't like how over there so easily is death. Look at this. That's a big platform. That was satisfying splash. And then the robots fly back. Woo! What in the hell happened? Ouch. So I need Plasto, Ingot, Copper, and Lubricant. Copper. Uh, and then Plasto, Ingot. Remind me to do that next episode. And then this will be the Neptune gain try, whatever. Gain try, whatever. Whatever, whatever, whatever. Look at this. I can even go right here. This is about to be where the rocket's going to be. Look at all those cool animations. Oh, God. The game does not like me doing something like that. Like, almost certain death kills me. Alright, let's go. I love how there's an open top. So, in normal Subnautica, this right here, this whole thing I made, is not in normal Subnautica. Only these right here. Only these little uh, dome balls things. Those are the only thing, like, this is just not in normal Subnautica. I do not believe at all. Yeah, it's not. So you just had to make a bunch of those, I believe, and not these. But then when Simonic Below Zero came out, I believe they put these in the game because people love them so much, which is understandable because look at this. I have so much room where I could be like, yeah, this is one side of my base. Here's right here. Here's little fishies. Here's this. And then, then you go to the one of these rooms and you're like, here's the fishes. That's all the room I got. <laughs> Feed me some food before I go. But yeah, we have the plan. Arthur? I have a plan, Arthur. 
Imagine if I did a series on Red Dead Redemption, the cowboy game. That would be crazy. But yeah, that's the end of the episode. So you guys have a good day and uh, peace out. Bye-bye.